Janelle here, the expert to follow to become genuinely happy, wildly successful, and a dynamic leader. This is Midweek Momentum. You may not know this, but I've actually been known to fire clients. So clients come to me and they say, this is where I am and this is where I want to go, whether that be in their career, their relationships, their health, their personal growth and development, they have a goal, right? They're here, this is where they want to go. And as a coach, I help to move them in this direction. But what has to happen in between, right? They need to take action steps to move themselves in that direction. And as their coach, I'm going to suggest things that I know are going to move them in that direction. So as a coach, I guarantee my results. I guarantee that when you come in and work with me, you're going to move yourself from point A to point B, which you desire. So if a client isn't willing to do what has to be done in between and do those action steps necessary, what am I supposed to do as a coach? Not only as a coach, but as a coach who guarantees their results, I need to have clients who actually are willing to do the work. In fact, I only want to work with clients who are actually willing to do the work. So I have been known to ask clients to go and see someone else or to just um, discontinue seeing me because they're not willing to put in the action steps. So this is what happened the other day. I have a goal in mind that I want to work towards and I was laying out steps that I needed to do and I was kind of taking extra long getting started. So I got really real with myself and I asked myself, Janelle, if you were your client, if I was my client, would I fire myself? <laughs> my answer was yes. In that day, I would have fired myself. So that got my butt in gear to start to take action and move myself in the direction that I wanted to go. So now, every time that I'm starting a new project or have a new goal in mind, if I haven't really started to take as much action as I want to. I just asked myself that question. Would I fire myself if I was my client? All right, here's my challenge for you. If you were your own coach, helping you move in that new direction and achieve those goals you want to achieve, would you fire yourself? Are you truly taking the amount of action that you need to get that goal? Are you truly doing 100% of the work necessary to get that goal? And I don't mean a quarter of it or half of it or three quarters, 90% of it, 99% of it, 100%. Because to get the goal, to get 100% of what you want, you need to put in 100% of the effort. I always share this tip with my clients is that if you're not 100% supporting yourself, by support, that's taking the action necessary to move yourself forward. If you're not 100% supporting yourself, then you're sabotaging yourself. So if you're only 90% in or 99% in to get your goal, you're sabotaging yourself. Get all in and get real with yourself. Would you fire yourself if you were your coach? Make it a great day. It's always a pleasure to be here for more ways to become genuinely happy, wildly successful, and a dynamic leader. Follow along and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The website is still on its way. Make it a great day.